Hello everybody, my name is Davidson and welcome back to another video and today I'm on Pokemon Showdown once again for a Gen 8 Anything Goes match this time and I'm going to be using my favorite Anything Goes team that I have just created recently. So I'm going to show you guys why some of these members in here are extremely underrated, especially Kale Rex. But anyways, let's go ahead and find an opponent here. Uh, they also have an Evoltal and an Eternatus. And a Kale Rex. Okay. Uh, maybe more people do understand how good they are. Uh, Ferrothorn. Okay, whatever. So, here's why Evoltal is good. is Oblivion Wing. It is 120 power after stab. Because it's always going to be stab. Because it's only Pokemon that can learn is Evoltal. And then also, it heals three-fourths of what you do to it. So, that's really nice. <coughs> um, this guy sent in his Evoltal as well. Um, knockoff. Okay, I mean, it doesn't really matter, because we have Oblivion Wing, and my item was a berry that healed me whenever I got low, so, um, we'll go ahead and, oh, the timer's already started, alright, uh, 28%, oh no, this thing has roost, Are you kidding me, come on, just Oblivion Wing, that's all we need, wait a minute, he's gonna lose the flying type, right? I thought I saw something that said he loses the flying type this turn. The opposing... Oh, I lose the flying type. Okay. Alright. Uh, this might be a long battle if we just keep Oblivion winging and uh, he keeps using Roost. So, I'll just update you guys. Oh, okay, I won't update you guys. I was going to say I'll update you guys once something happens, but something happened. Okay, um, the only problem is Oblivion Wing only has 16 power points, but, you know, still, it's very good for this. Yes, he missed the Thunder Wave. Alright, if he got the Paralysis off, that would have been really annoying. Okay, 10% left. Oh no, he got the Paralysis. Please break through, just one turn. Oh, okay, he's switching. Oblivion Wing, 28 Okay, um, yeah, I guess we'll just keep using Oblivion Wing then. Knock off doesn't really matter at this point. I don't know why he's using that, especially since it's resisted now. Okay, um, Roost. Oh my gosh, this thing is so annoying. Maybe I should add Roost to this one. I don't know, though. My main move is the one that heals me, so it doesn't really matter. The rest of the moves are just uh, in case some bad situation happens, because otherwise I'm just spamming Oblivion Wing. So, like, Sucker Punch is if I need to outspeed and I don't or something. U-Turn is if I need to switch out and I can do some damage in the same turn. And then uh, Toxic is in case I want to poison it because of it's like resist Oblivion Wing or something. Um, anyways, I got less evasion, but that doesn't really matter. Because, you know, he's not using any moves like Blizzard or anything. Uh, okay, we're about out of Oblivion Wings. So then, I think we're going to switch. Because this guy is just... He is uh, not being very nice to me right now. So we're going to U-turn. And we're going to U-turn into Kale Rex, actually. Oh yeah, he, lose, he does lose the Flying type. Because U-turn super effective. Okay. Uh, as you can see, I've given this thing a bunch of EVs, a good item, and a plus attack stat, Nature. And its attack is 706. That is absolutely ridiculous. And hopefully this will still kill. Yep. He knocked off the choice band, which stinks. Uh, but now I have 1.5 times attack. Alright. Uh, who's he gonna send out next? We still have no members down, and he has one down, but all of mine are awakened. Well, all the ones that are good, other than Eternatus. Um, you know what? We're actually gonna do this. I know it's a weird play. Oh, it's a special move, and he outsped, so it doesn't even matter. I should have looked at that first. Okay, then we'll, we'll fight Eternatus with Eternatus. Draco me here. Oh, we used Dynamax Cannon in one shot, man. Of course he won the speed tie. Whatever, uh, Dragonite. Dragonite can do the same job as Eternatus, just not as well. 
Um, well, ice beam for that freeze chance. Oh my gosh, stop. Stop using Dynamax Cannon. Come on, Evolts all. It's not as good anymore. Um, hopefully I can get the Toxic off without dying. But of course he got a crit. Of course he did. Um, alright, Gardevoir's got 523 special attack. My friend actually made this Gardevoir. I didn't make the Gardevoir. I just, uh, copy and pasted the, uh, stuff for it into my team after he made it. Because it's pretty good. Um, Moonblast, okay. Oh, yeah, he has a choice item. Great. Uh, Dragon Dance. Okay, he doesn't want to sweep me with, uh... Eternatus anymore. He wants to sweep me with Necrozma instead. Alright, buddy. I see how it is. Honestly, this guy is probably going to win. This battle did not go so well for me. This is a bad demonstration of this awesome team. This guy just has an even better team. Um, okay. Uh, if he's ever going to attack, then he'd probably be doing it right about now. Because he's on 13%. Um, yeah, he's definitely gonna attack here. No, he healed, okay. Alright. Well, we just have to keep on doing this. Uh, eventually, he'll stop. Oh my goodness. Why is this guy so annoying? He has a healing move on every single one of his Pokemon and the leftovers. And Max Steel Spike, and now we die. Now, finally, we have a Blissey with, uh, 651 HP. So, that's nice. Um, surely we can survive a hit from this. Uh, then we'll go for Earthquake. Oh, nope. It, okay. Well, guys, that was a really bad demonstration of the team, like I said. But I usually win with this team, but this guy was just too good. Uh, you can see my rating's 1162, so that proves that I don't lose like this every time. But maybe I'll make another demonstration of this team in the future, because I don't want anybody thinking it's bad. I didn't really get to show off all the Pokemon's powers, either. Like, I've gotten Kale Rex up to 1,700 attack stat before, and then he's just unbeatable. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.